Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Oh, I didn't even notice there's a tanker right over there. Huh. Um. And in today's video, we're going to be playing some SnowRunner. And I'm not even going to attempt to say the name, because I have no idea, but Northern Installation is what we'll call it. So we just came in. Um. I guess, I don't know if there's another entrance, but it doesn't look like it. Um, I think the plan is we'll just go straight to these two and then over here maybe. So we'll try that I guess. And I should probably make it day so it's easier to see. We'll just start out with uh, mid-afternoon and then if it gets dark we'll switch it again. I saw that area when I came in which looks really really rough. And, uh, I have both the Zixi 605R and the Tuz. Oh, you know what? I should have probably, uh, checked up on that fuel. So I'm going to do that quick. Before I... I'll cut this out, but I'm going to run back and grab fuel. If I can, I guess. I don't even know. Alright, so there's a task over there, but for some reason it wouldn't let me pick it up when I ran into it. I'll probably have to quit the game and come back for it to allow me to accept it, but it's right at the uh, tunnel entrance there, so I guess I'm not too worried about it. Next time or whatever, I can just pick it up. Ooh, holy smokes. Alright. This does not look like friendly territory up here for the Tuz. And I brought in the Zixi 605R, oh my gosh. Just because um, I like to use that to explore. That thing is just so good. So, and that's part of the reason why I like the Tuz 420 Tatarin. Just, this thing is so good too. Well, I already blew out a tire, I didn't notice that. I knew I hit some stuff, but dang, we really smoked it. Wait, is that where I want to go? No. Well, maybe. We'll follow the road for now, though. Alright. So far, this place looks... oh, maybe we won't follow this road. We'll accept it. Um, I'm not sure if this is crossable. Yeah. I mean, it looks like it might be, but I think we're better off taking that road. Wait, is that, is that a trailer? I don't know what that is. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna go back and just take that road. This does not look like a road at all on the map. I was kind of confused when I looked at it, because I was like, uh, I don't really see any roads. It's fairly uh, densely covered in trees, so... It's a little easier to see the roads on non-snowy maps, just because the color of the ground. But on these snowy maps, it's pretty tough. Alright, we're going to go to the right. Is that what I was looking at? Oh, it is. It's a bridge. Yeah, we'll go to the right. It was nice to top up on fuel. Jeez, this doesn't look very nice. But yeah, um, I don't think I'm supposed to use that fuel because it was for a mission, but... I don't know, I took fuel from it and it seems to be working okay. Oh, this... I'm not really supposed to be going across here, am I? This looks like a pretty steep uh, route down, but we'll try it. I thought the road kept going somewhere, but it doesn't look like it does. Wait, we gotta find a way across this too. 
Um, we'll check in just a second. Oh man. Oh. Oops, not recover, repair. There we go. Again, I'm gonna save the rest of my repair points. Um, looks like we can cross over here. Oh shoot, I didn't notice we were going in, sinking in. That was just a bad combination right there. Totally broke our gas tank. But yeah, like I was saying, um, I, I keep some repair points in case I hit the tank again, and that way it doesn't just ruin the mission. Or, I guess I'm not really on a mission, but you know what I mean. I have to quit because we break the tank too much, which is a pretty good possibility at this stage. Man, this is going to be a tough tough area if all this ice is breakable. Oh shoot. I've never had that happen before. Usually once you get onto this part you're, you're good. Maybe I'm just not far enough on it. That might have been it, yeah. So usually, yeah, once you get on this stuff, you're pretty, pretty well set. Wow. That is interesting. This thing's really struggling. And there's no trees, so we gotta just, uh, make do with whatever we can. There we go. All right, well, I think we're across. It looks as though we're coming up on the... Oh, nice. A little tank stuck in the ice there. Coming up on the watchtower up here on the right. I was going to try and make it inside that tree, but... Sometimes it's easier just to go around. I'm tempted just to run right up the hill, but... I won't. Uh oh. Probably should have looked out where I'm going a little better because I went right in the middle. Here we go, we're coming up on the first one here. That's a nice view. Those huts look kind of weird. I have no idea which way is which, but we came in from this side, so we'll keep the map that way. Okay. Wow. So where we are it does not look like a, any sort of a road. We'll have to go back down the way we came and looks like around the ice and Oh man. Yeah, I'm not sure if it'd be easier to go to the top one or bottom one at this point, because if we're going over to here, it might be easier to go this way. Yeah, I think we will. We'll just follow this road. We'll go to the bottom one. Ah. There we go. This could be an issue. I'm going to try and ride the uh, right side with all the rocks and stuff and hopefully not break through. Oh, man. This is not good. Because we could easily get stuck on these rocks as well. Uh -oh. Wait, can we not go through here? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. There's... Oh, I gotta cross it and go... Ah, alright. That's disappointing. I think this ice we're on is good though. It looks like you can kind of see that little different color of the ice there. Oh, I lied. Oh, I, I definitely lied. There we go. There we go. Yes. Alright, which is safety. Sort of. Alright, we're going to try and ride the left side here. Get as close. Oh, sh oh, dang, man. I 
this stinks. Oh, there we go. There we go. Alright. Now we're on sort of a road. I think. Thousand meters to go still, jeez. Really? You didn't give me one engine damage for that. Oh, and if you guys are wondering why the tank's different colored, I... I, um, sold it. And bought it back. I don't remember why I sold it. I needed the money for something. And I have three of them. And this and the Zixies are the only vehicles that I have more than one of now, because I've... I know for a long time I just kept every vehicle I found, but then I, I sold, like, the CK-1500 and the extra Hummer and stuff like that. Oh, and the extra Kodiak. But yeah, we just have one of everything except for the, um... Tuz 420 and the 6605Rs. And, like I said at the start of this, those ones are just so good. That's why I have a few of them. But yeah, I didn't uh, paint this one. I just upgraded it and then went off to do this exploring. I'm going to go to the left here. There we go. Uh-oh. This looks like another not good area to pass up here. Oh, there's a mission too. Dang it. We gotta clear this rock fall to get that way. At least it looks like it. Yeah, dang it. Well, it looks like the only option is to go to our right. And even that looks like a pretty bad option. But... I don't know. I need... well... I want to explore around this map, and I mean I could fix this stuff to do it, but I just have I have so much more fun just going in there and exploring and you know figuring where everything out figuring out where everything is for the first time. Oh, there's like a little oh we're back on the road. Well, that wasn't bad at all. Is this that same contract, or is this... Wait, what, really? We can't go through that? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh yeah, I just... I have so much more fun getting in there and exploring before I build any bridges or fix any rock slides or anything like that. I just like to go out and explore it and kind of get the watchtowers and if there's any upgrades and start some tasks find any trailers and that kind of stuff. I like to pull all the trailers back and sell them all, too. Just get some extra money. This looks like ice. I think it is. I think we're still a long ways away from that. 500 meters? Man. Alright, do we go left or right? Well, never mind. We're not on the road. I guess we took a little shortcut. It's funny though, sometimes you just barely get off the road and your vehicle slows down so much. Oh shoot, that was half the gas tank. That's not good. One more big hit to the gas tank and then we're 
I mean, we only have enough heal or repair points to repair it, like, yeah. So, now it's just, wherever we hit, that's it. Unless we run across a repair trailer or something, some kind of repair point. But judging by the amount of damage we've gotten so far, we probably won't make it all the way to the third watchtower, to be honest. I'm trying to turn to the left, and it's sucking me into the right. I don't know if you guys can see that. Alright, do I turn here? Is that the... Yeah, it looks like the right way. Man, this is going to be rough. 400 meters off-road. Alright, it's getting to be night. I'll switch it back to day in just a little bit here. And then we'll uh, probably run out the rest of the day, or unless we run out of gas or repair points. But we're going to try and get all three watchtowers and see what we can find. I suppose I could turn on the lights at least so you guys can see a little better. Dang it. Took some more uh, damage on the gas tank there. Oh, I thought that I was like, what? Well, yeah, where do we go? Oh, it's, it is straight, wow. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No freaking way, dude. Well, I'm just gonna try and make it to this watch point. Come on, man, pull me. Seriously? Dude, come on. There we go. I'm just going to try and make it to this watch point, and then I'll switch to the Zixi and see if we can make it to the other one. I don't know if we'll have... I don't think we will have enough to get to this one. We're just... We're losing so much fuel. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I think we'll make it. I think we got an extra 120. And yes, we're losing it fast, but... Um, I think we have enough time to make it there. We're still 300 meters. We haven't really gotten any closer. It's just been winding around. But yeah, I think we got it. Oh, it just is annoying when I do that. It's happened a few times when I've been doing the exploring videos. Well, actually, one of the times it didn't, uh, I couldn't record, or mm, I recorded it, but somehow lost the save file. All right, let's refuel. Everything we got, 126, so if we can't make it there on this, then I guess we'll have to do it with another vehicle, because that's all we got. I'm really hoping we can make it there. Alright. 107, I can see it now. Try and winch yourself with whatever... whatever with whatever we can. Maybe save a little bit on fuel. Maybe. Oh yeah, we're good now. Oh, that's a relief. I really didn't want to have to run all the way over here. Wait, there's a mission up here? There is a mission. I can't see anything. Alright, what is this? We'll try and start this. Get the scout to the weather station. Where's the scout at? Holy smokes! That is a long ways away. Alright. 
we're gonna stop, we're gonna switch the truck. And I will, uh, I'll skip this up to where we uh, crossed the river on the last one. So basically to where we would have left off if we had the tank. Kind of. Alright guys, so last time we went straight, or I guess to our right, at this part. This time we take a, took a left and crossed that bridge that I was wondering what, what, what it was on the map earlier. Looks like we got some missions up here. Yeah, bring some cargo containers or something here. Let's check out what this is. So we gotta visit some places. Hopefully one of them is... Oh man. Well, I guess we'd have to go all the way over there anyways. Alright. I think we take a right here. Hard to see with that big symbol. But yeah. So we're gonna go down this hill. And I think I found a place where we'll be able to cross the river, but I might be- Oh shoot, I did not see that rock. Oh man. I don't know if you guys could see the rock through that tree that I was talking about, but... Oh, come on. Alright, so... I'll point it out on the map here in just a sec when I get up closer to the shore. So instead of crossing here, I think we're gonna cross here. It looks... oops. Looks pretty sketchy. But I think if we can make it here, we can maybe go up this way and then down here and cross and... I don't know, maybe we'll go this way and follow the roads, but we'll see. These uh, Phase 4 maps are definitely tough, man. The very first one, just everywhere you go was tough. And I remember the exploring video in Cosmodrome. It was like... Everywhere I went was blocked by something, trees and rocks and... Yeah. Ooh. I'm honestly not even sure how I got to one of the spots. Um, and if you guys have played that map, you will know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, if you're looking at the map normally, from where you come in, I guess, I don't know if there's multiple ways to get in. No, I don't think so. But, um, where your garage is, to the right, and then down, like, halfway down the map, there's a huge ice mountain. And I tried, well, I actually, I think I did get up there with the cat, 745C. I think it took me, like, an hour, or an hour and a half of just trying, oh no, I remember what I did, I went down the river after I tried for a super, super long time. Um, yeah, I just followed the ice, because the cat's one of the few vehicles that, um, if it gets, like, the ice that you can break through, you can actually get yourself back up on top of it with the cat. So it's one of the few vehicles that you can actually do that with. I'm not sure how many more there are, but I know the cat 745C can do it. So that's what I did. I drove through the river pretty much. And was able to get to the bottom half of the map to go get some, I think it was metal planks to bring those up and clear the rock slide, something like that. I mean, this looks really rough crossing here, but it's actually been pretty easy. Whoa. Alright, do I... I can go to the right, but I can also go to the left. I think we'll go to the left. Oh, we're sinking. Alright, I think we're in close range of few trees at least. I'm not sure if the 6605R can get out of the... the oh, jeez. Dude, that is some deep stuff. Wow. I probably should have went straight instead of to the left. 
Which way should we go? I think we should go to the right and follow this through and maybe go that way. That's so weird. This is like right... That was like the first road we were on right at the beginning. And we might go right back to it. I think, yeah, we'll go this way. Oh, I know. We'll go this way and then loop around this way. And see where this road goes. Yeah, that's what we did. I'm thinking, and then I'm trying to remember that my vehicle's running at the same time, so I want to get moving. Oh wow, this is a uh, broken wall here, so we're probably not supposed to go this way. Am I on the right track? Yeah, okay. Oh, look at that big building up there. Well, this looks pretty pretty tough, actually. I would not like to take a trailer through here. Or not even a trailer, just anything. This reminds me of a... Uh, I was going to say a mirror, but that's where we're at. Um, Imandra, that's what I was thinking of. Man, some of those trails in Imandra. Oof. Those were... Especially getting the garage set up. Man, I, I took the wrong trail in that. That was some really tough sledding. It's weird that they have this little wall. It actually makes it tougher. <laughs> because, like, if you're on the road, you are staying on the road, kind of thing. Or if you're off the road, same thing. You, you're not getting in, you know? Some of this stuff is just tough, really tough. Like this is one of the best vehicles and it's, it's handling it pretty easy, but just if you had any sort of a load on there, it would be tough. I actually just saw the last watchtower. There I can see it on the top of the screen there. That was a good couple of second view of it. But yeah, I like this part. You know, you gotta go up on this rock to get around this tree. If you had anything in your trailer... I shouldn't say even trailer. Anything in your... bed. Oh no! This bridge is out. I didn't notice that. Alright. Uh, well. I think it looks like we can cross fairly easily to our right. I'm going to switch it back to mid-afternoon. Oh wait, there's a trail that goes off there. Hey. Alright, let's go back down to the shore. There we go. Yeah. This is looking fresh up here. Yeah, it looks nice. That's a good choice. Good route. I like it. Which way do we go now, though? Uh, left is closer to it. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I can see it. Making our way there. Whoa, 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 whoa. I did not even see those rocks. Like sometimes with snow cover, it's really tough to see. Like it's just, you know, it's covered in white. Oh, 
man, this is some rough, rough roads. Honestly, I figured I'd already be done exploring this by now. And I'm not even, like, really that close to the third one. I mean, yeah, I guess looking at it on the map now, it does look kind of tough. It's hard to tell. Because, like, you know, there's, it's not super detailed, but, like, you can kind of tell, you know, it's going uphill and loops back right back around, so it's not going to be the easiest of terrain. There we go. We're up into gear four. We're cruising now. We're going to get there. We're up into five. Yeah, all that just to get back to here. This is where we would have been. There we go. Perfect. Back up into gear four. I don't know if you guys know this, but if you if you um, either hold LB and go up into high and back to uh, automatic, you can upshift easier. Like basically, you can skip some gears and go faster. Or I guess I learned this like I don't know a month or so ago. You can just tap LB. So you just tap LB like three times and then. It'll usually shift you up to second, third, and fourth, or something. Holy cow. Are you serious? My goodness, this is tough. I say this because I know I have one of the best vehicles, and I'm struggling with it, like... Honestly, guys, I don't know how to pass this little rocks. We're through. There. My goodness. Seriously, why was that so hard? Am I not supposed to go that route? Like this? This doesn't seem even, even drivable. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Wow. Dude, this, this mountain pass here is freaking ridiculous. Wow. Yeah, I, uh, I flipped it trying to get, just get over this little rocky area. So, alright, I guess that's where we're going to end it, guys. Thank you guys for watching. If you want to watch another video, there's a random video on screen and another playlist. Please be sure to share the video, like it, comment, and subscribe. Turn on those bell notifications so you're notified when I upload, and until next time, peace.